One in three teenagers have online regrets. How many of you posted something online that you regret? I saw a the internet's an awesome place. You know, it's like having the world's library in your pocket. But with that comes responsibility, and we're here to help those young people understand what that responsibility is. So we all carry a mobile device in our pocket. That mobile device has lots of personal data on it, and of course we communicate with lots of other people on it. But also in doing that, it's tracking us by our location, it's posting our data, and it's giving away lots of information about us that, that's stored on it. We need to be conscious and understand what's being shared and with whom. Do you know what's out there about you? Well, last night, I looked at what I could find out about somebody I don't know. This is a person who was on a riverboat last night. You don't want to overshare your data. Yeah, I, maybe I don't want to share my location, I don't want to share my home address and things like that. So I need to set my privacy settings so I'm not giving those things away to anybody out there in the internet. Oh, I Google myself, a lot, a lot of things came up. A lot of things came up. Be prepared that anything you put online, anything you take digitally, potentially is going to stay with you for life. Curiously, there's an article about me online that was a paper article 20 years ago. Yeah, that I said something really silly in. Yeah, so I, there's things out there that I regret that actually were never meant to be on that. Yeah, I'm worth $15 on Facebook. You're the product. If something's for free, somebody's making money out of you somehow. I'm worth $146 on Twitter. AVG Privacy Fix gives you an estimation of how much you're worth online. Um, it, will, it will calculate how frequently you post, how big your network is, etc., and give an estimation of your advertising worth. Uh, to companies. Locking your privacy settings down, you'll see that value go down. I've got my house address, I've got, it tells me, it's got, it tells me my brother and sister that they're my other occupants. I want the young people we've talked to today to understand that the content on the internet about them belongs to them and they should manage that. But also, they need to take the message on and they need to teach their parents and they need to teach their friends how to stay safe online.